Hey, what's up guys, I'm Furious Pete, and yes, this is a shoulder workout. You guys asked for it, we're gonna get these baseballs all pumped up. So, enough talking. Let's get right into this fucking workout. to begin with. Uh, this really just loosens everything up, kind of, well, loosens up and destroys everything. So, you don't really need super heavy weight for this. We're gonna try and keep the form strict. Of course, by strict, I mean we're not gonna use our legs to assist in the actual push movement. We're just gonna try and use our shoulders to push through. Remember, we wanna fully extend, and uh, yeah, it's all about form with this one. So, let's do this. shrugs. Now we'll often see uh, people in the gym leaning forward and doing some shrugs, uh, just doing different positions that sometimes just don't make a lot of sense. If you think about it, your traps are back here. They're not in the front where your chest are. So you want to kind of make sure that you know your movement is towards the trap and you really are squeezing that trap at the top because that's really what provides the growth and you know that's how you're able to actually tear up the muscles. So we're gonna make sure that when we're holding dumbbells here, so we're gonna do dumbbell shrugs, we're really pushing to the back. We're really squeezing the trap at the top. We're not just lifting up like this because you're not targeting the trap when you do that. When you're sitting at home right now and you're lifting up your arms like that, 
you will not feel your trap being squeezed. However, when you're pulling back like that, you definitely are. So, let's get to it. We're gonna keep the dumbbells just the back a little bit. And like I said, we're gonna move backwards. Shrug back. We're not gonna try and go forwards like this, because really, we're not really doing anything for the traps. They're in the back. We want to shrug back and squeeze at the top. Don't be afraid to just hold it at the top too. Time to cool off with a little bit of, uh, well, they're front raises, but we can use, you can either use dumbbells or you can just use a plate, like so. Lift up. So we're gonna start off with a 45. Try not to sway your body too much. And lift it up decently high above, so your arms kind of patch your ears. If you can't do any more of those, we're gonna switch this down to another weight, just a lower weight. If you're doing a 25 to begin with, maybe switch to a 10. You know, dumbbells as well, just go down about 50%. And uh, we're gonna do this uh, plate just to failure, so. Really, this is just a cool down. This shouldn't be really too difficult. However, we have a lot of lactic acid that builds up in our shoulders throughout this workout and therefore this can get very sore and tiring quickly. Uh. Alright that's it for today guys. We can do more but what's the point? We tore it up we lifted heavy, we lifted well, and the shoulders are ready to grow again when we feed them up tonight with a lot of food. Also remember that the shoulder is actually engaged in other workouts, in other exercises that include the chest, the back, the biceps, and others. Even like when you're doing deadlifts, you are incorporating the traps and the shoulders when you are lifting up that weight. So, that is it for today. I think we did a good job. I hope you guys enjoyed the workout. Please let me know what else, what other workouts you guys wanna see. I'll do my best to, uh, to get those done and get them up here on Furious Pete. Make sure you are subscribed to this channel. Like it, like up this video. Please like up this video. Share it with your friends if you did enjoy it. I'll see you guys next time, of course. Stay with me guys, right now. Stay sexy. Stay hungry. Make sure you're too furious for your sleeves. And of course, get laid, my friends. Yo!